Well, it's become one of the hottest debates in recent years, whether or not to rename Columbus Day Indigenous Peoples Day. Yeah, a few months ago, it got pretty heated in Randolph, New Jersey, where the school district there voted to do so, then reverse course. Well, now neighboring Rockaway considering the same thing. Yeah, Pick 7 James Ford is there tonight with the story. Welcome to Rockaway Township. This North Jersey community is right off Interstate 80, which is also officially named the Christopher Columbus Highway. And it's that man, long considered the first European to discover the Americas, who's at the center of controversy here and elsewhere. Um, Christopher Columbus never actually entered what we consider the United States. He was in Hispaniola, Jamaica, the coast of South America and Central America. Columbus has been referenced by scholars, including from Harvard University, as the most important man in history. He is the accepted father of the modern world. A variety of views about Columbus expressed at a school board meeting here Wednesday night. Historical research showing that the explorer abused indigenous people in the New World have led some educational institutions nationwide to no longer honor Columbus by name. Here, the October holiday named after Columbus was changed on the school calendar to Indigenous Peoples Day. Some local residents contacted an Italian-American advocacy group which lobbied the school board to return to the old name, but local Native American tribe members say they prefer the new name. It's become a back and forth. Eileen DeFries, a Ramapo Nation elder, serves on the State Commission on American Indian Affairs. It's that old kind of thinking, colonialism, you know, is the key when colonialism we know now has just devastated different peoples all over the world. Andre Domino leads the Italian American One Voice Coalition. He spoke at Wednesday night's meeting. Three of the board members were hoodwinked when they voted on the change to the calendar earlier in the year because they weren't told that they were changing Columbus Day. And last night they put a motion forward to restore Columbus Day to the calendar. But three other board members voted against that. All right, well, that was James Ford reporting for us tonight. There was a similar situation earlier in the summer in Randolph, New Jersey. Again, in that case, a school board ended up reinstating the Columbus Day holiday. There is going to be a vote in Rockaway on October the 27th. And, of course, we will be sure to follow it for you.